Just being attached to myself to the AJJ event, and it's uh, I mean, it's like a dream come true, you know, in a way. So um, yeah, I, I couldn't afford to play AJJ when I was a kid, and to kind of. The fact that I have my name on term is kind of brings it back full circle, but hopefully using you know this this opportunity to, to to promote the game of golf and again just so kids can see like you know I can I can do it and one of my sayings that I always love to say is is you can't be what you don't see. My whole goal is is just to you know try my best to bring visible equity to golf and you know put myself in a platform to where you know kids can see that I can do that, especially kids that come from my community. Um, I have a podcast on NBC called Beyond the Fairway, where we just just golf talk from a different clubhouse. Um, also, I uh, have a show on uh, NBC Golf Pass called Home Course Advantage. And, you know, that's just, you know, helping kids to, or, or anybody who's in the game of golf trying to pursue and stay within the game of golf and grow the game of golf. And we just kind of want to make sure we help meet those needs. So I just really want to think outside the box when it comes to growing the game and, and hopefully put you know things in position where people can kind of grow through the game of golf. I, I was a big tennis player. Um, uh, I, I was, tennis was my, is my first passion, my first love, and I had a two-hand forehand and two-hand backhand. So when I uh, grabbed the club, I just naturally grabbed it, you know, left hand low, and I just, uh, I thought I was right. And you know, the, the you know, the looks are you're weird. You know, I get a lot of crazy looks, especially when I you know when I played in in the APGA and you know PJ Latin tour events and it was like what in the world is about to happen? But uh, you know, I I uh, I break a lot of rules in a golf swing. <laughs> I'm, I'm crossing every line at the top and at the bottom and over the side. So but it is definitely a swing God only a mother could love. I'm happy to see that companies are starting to realize that you know being in the DEI space is a key business enabler. I see that companies are starting to recognize that, and I'm and I'm happy to see it. Um, and you know, you see a lot of companies are, are really trying their best to to provide equity and to provide inclusion. I hope in years to come, you know, companies can start realizing how to add emphasis on inclusion and just not making sure that it's a it's a one-off exchange, you know. But uh, I'm just happy to see that, you know, the conversations are starting to be had and much needed conversations are, are, are starting to uh, to take place. Even I see, you know, when it, when it comes to like a diverse workforce, you know, and I'm starting to see AJGA having a lot more diverse, diverse voices, you know, when it comes to operating events. And I, I'm so happy uh, here at the World Hour Championship is that, you know, I've, I've seen a lot of different a lot of different ethnic groups, a lot of uh, you know men and women who are out here trying to you know be a part of the game. And one thing I really appreciate it, that you know I think would enhance that you guys are such a world oil machine. I love the fact that you know you provide opportunity a different way. Because I, I talked to some uh, some interns and and you know they said uh, I'm like how long have you been playing golf? I, I, I don't play golf. I'm like what? And I think that's a, I think that's it's, it's genius. That's genius, and, and that's how you pretty much grow the game of golf. So the kids that we have here uh, come from Steph Curry's underrated uh, golf tour, which is now partnered with KPMG and Mariah Stackhouse. And you know, it, seeing you know the whole point of, of underrated and AJGA partnering was to you know provide you know stars for kids that uh, play in big events and play in AJGA events where uh, can increase the chances of being um, recognized by college coaches. And you know, seeing that um, that a lot of these kids uh, you know are are trying to get into the upper echelon of golf and having AJJ and underrated partner is amazing. So we have four kids that come from the underrated golf tour and these kids are amazing. And, I, and I'm so happy that I had opportunity to, to, to bring those kids over to the AJJ event to uh, you know, just showcase their, their, their skill set on another stage. Those, those my, I mean, I, those are my little homies, man. Those, those are my little homies. And, 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 I, and, I, and, I, and to see the joy in their face, and it sounds so corny when you say it, like, man, I, you know, I hear it all the time on TV. But to see the joy in their face, it brings so much joy to me. It really does. Like, it, it really does. It really kind of warms my heart to see how happy they are and their parents are appreciative. Like, you don't have to thank me no more. This, this, is, this is supposed to happen. This is, this is what's supposed to happen. So um, anytime I get a chance to have an opportunity to, to, to pay it forward, uh, I'm, I'm, that's what I'm going to do. It's easy.